Hey guys, we're here to talk to you about what we can do about our gross school lunches. Back in middle school, one of my friends forgot to bring her packed lunch to school. She hated school lunches so much that she started bawling when she realized she had to eat one. U.S. school lunches have improved over the years, but they are still lacking in nutrition and taste, especially when compared to other first world countries. Korean school lunches are a bit different than most American school lunches. There, there is always something delicious to be had. In France, each school lunch has to include a main dish based on meat, fish, eggs, or cheese. One also must include a, a side dish, a dairy product, and either a starter or dessert. The nutritional standards regulate how frequently dishes are served in a 20 meal cycle. For example, at least 10 meals in the cycle must be accompanied by cooked vegetables. 10 meals with starchy foods or cereals, and 8 meals with a fresh fruit dessert. In the United States, where obesity rates have tripled over the past three decades, even the healthiest choices are generally cooked off-site, frozen, and then reheated. These foods are forced to compete in cafeterias with all things fried, salty, and sweet. Schools in Japan, by contrast, give the children the sort of food they'd get at home, not at a stadium. The meals are often made from scratch, they're balanced but hearty. Sunset's lunches are better than the average U.S. school lunch. Sunset's head cafeteria lady, Linda, said how she gets organic and locally grown fruits and vegetables whenever she can. This is a great step towards improving school food, but it is not enough. If I have second lunch when Linda got fresh strawberries or some other fresh fruit, they are usually all gone by the time I get my food. One way we could get more healthy food was suggested by our health teacher, Mrs. Ariano, and that's having a school garden. Not only would this provide us with more organic food, but it could also be a club or part of the Northwest Ecology class. The best way to get better food is to raise funding for our schools. The budgets are decided in Congress, so we should write letters to our district representative, Suzanne Bonamici, and our senators, Ron Wyden and Jeff Merkley. Fun fact, one-eighth of a cup of tomato sauce is considered a vegetable by the USDA. That's right, folks. We grow pizzas and farms now. Fuck you.